Well, April Fools, everyone. I guess. <laughs> hey, everyone. Good to see you all. It's me, Shell Shock Prime. And good to see you, Noble Boy. Good to see you, H Bomb and Friends. Good to see you, Hito. Um, so it's April first. Today is the start of a new month. Uh, so yeah, I'm doing like a just chatting stream for April Fools. <laughs> I don't know exactly what's going to happen today, but I'm just like, you know, let's just see what happens and find out. Um, but later tonight, I'm going to be doing Sonic Shuffle Madness with the Madness crew. Not Mario Party Madness, but Sonic Shuffle Madness tonight at 8.30. So hopefully you guys can tune in for that later on tonight. And then we got some party animals tomorrow. Wednesday is La Mulana. La Mulana returns. And Thursday will be Princess Beach Showtime and no stream in the weekend. But yeah, like there's a there's a non-zero chance that some some sort of shenanigans will be happening today. There's a non-zero chance that we're going to see something extremely wild that you probably wonder exactly what I'm going to be doing today. I have a lot planned or so do I think I do or so do you think um, there's there's definitely going there's definitely a lot. <laughs> he means the opposite. <laughs> I mean, it's a zero. It's a zero chance that um, that you that things are what they say they are. Um, so you see, um, I think in my personal opinion that the lucky number today is zero because it's April Fools. So just having um, the number zero representing today means a whole lot, and also the fact that we have. A zero chance of this stream being a normal stream we have a zero chance um, and I would say that if anyone was able to donate zero bits that'd be funny I gotta wish that twitch had it so that you it says oh you earn zero bits <laughs> now nah, but um, I've seen some I'm see I've seen some interesting April Fool stuff today like and yesterday as well because it started in Japan. Like I've seen um, a dating sim for Pal World. I've seen um, apparently like one of those like free free Steam codes, whatever. Say oh free Pal World, and then you get Rick Roll instead. Um, I've seen Sega Saturn Mini. I've seen uh, what else did I see today? Uh, Sonic the Hedgehog one, but with a big head mode. Um, Sonic, or rather, a Sega Genesis lock-on technology where you can lock on every single Genesis cartridge, um, at once, so it's not just Sonic and Knuckles, um, apparently there's a poisonous potato from Minecraft, um, there's a fan, a free fan game from Mega64 called Doug Hug'em, not Duke Nukem, but Doug Hug'em. Uh, that and also IGN actually had an April Fool's joke of their own where, um, where they claimed that Nintendo, Nintendo was going to make a VR Virtual Boy Pro. Thanks for the one, thanks for the one bit, Mercury. <laughs> the, the, the Virtual Boy Pro, <laughs> basically that's IGN's April Fool's joke this year. Um, it actually... It looks like a legit commercial for a moment until like you realize in the end it's not um there's been a lot of very weird april fool stuff t today um but yeah uh so today is like th there's been a lot of weird april fools jokes over the years like i remember there was like um a sega master system bayonetta game uh i've seen like different games well, different, different weird April Fool's games actually become games. Like, there was a fighting game called Fighting Fighting EX Layer. But I hope you're doing good, Mercury. Um, not to mention the fact that... Um, oh, Smiley Fright Season 2. Yes, that's happening. <laughs> not to mention the fact that we also had, um, at one point, um, an April Fool's joke about... Um, in nineteen in the nineteen nineties, um, the legendary one was I believe it was either Game Pro or EGM, 
where they covered Street Fighter 2, like the mystery character named Shenlong, who um, is a secret fighter. You have to meet certain requirements in order to fight him. And he's the guy who tr supposedly trained Ryu and Ken. In reality, um, such, char such character doesn't exist. Instead, we actually have a character named Goken, who actually looks a bit similar. And thanks for the follow. I really appreciate it. Um, we have like a lot of weird characters, a lot of weird games, and a lot of weird April Fool's jokes over the years. But that being said, um, so I keep mentioning Zero a lot. Hey, Dragon, good to see you. Like, there's like a zero chance we're gonna see something about um, about whatever it is I'm gonna do, but um, I think I think I think that the the number zero is going to have a huge significance for this stream today. At least this portion of the stream, not the, not the Sonic shuffle one for later on, not the Sonic shuffle one. That's, that's still happening later on tonight. Um, that's, as, that's going on as planned, but right now, what exactly am I talking about and why I'm actually saying, um, the number zero and non and there's a non zero chance or there's a zero chance and all that stuff. Um, well, I'll say this. I'm going to preface this to you guys. Have you ever wondered what it would be like to play Mega Man X1, but not as X, but as Zero? Have you ever just wondered that? Have you ever thought, hey, I would like to play Mega Man X1 as Zero. You can't play as him in that game, but it would have been nice to play as him. Have you ever just wondered that? Well... I'm going to do something that Capcom would not do. You had to wait until Mega Man X3 to play as Zero. But what if you want to play as him in Mega Man X1? Well, well, hey, Bowie with the streak. Thank you. Well, here we go. You see? Simon and TMNT 2 NES. Oh yeah, that is a thing, Noble Boy. That is absolutely a thing. You have zero instead of X. Cause zero was meant to um Zero was meant to be um the star of the show, but they ended up making a character that looked like classic Mega Man, but in a more futuristic form. Zero's a S-Class Maverick Hunter. That's basically X's face. I miss Think Geek. They always had good April Fool's products. Yeah, Think Geek was great before they got bought out by GameStop. Or at least the power GameStop's parent company. Alright, let's do it. Nope, it's not just chatting. That's the April Fool. So we're doing Mega Man X. Project Zero, Mega Man Z, Mega Man X as Zero instead of playing as X. Here we go. All right, let's modify the controls. Let's see, so A as dash. All right, so shot is Y. But some people tend to prefer um, R as dash. Yeah, I think I'm satisfied with this. All right, here we go. Here we go.
Did they actually make this a little bit harder to accommodate Zero? You want the Mega Man Z? I mean, we technically did get the, the, the Mega Man Zero series and the ZX, but in terms of the Mega Man X series, yeah, I would definitely agree. All right. All right, so let's go. Does this look weird to you guys? Yeah, because because this is a ROM hack. I had to patch the ROM to make sure that uh, this works. I'm not sure if Zero's Buster. Um, oh yeah, because you could play as Vile in the remake. I think there's also a ROM hack where you can play as Vile. Vile suck. Mm. Yeah, because I'm going to play the remake this year um, in May when, when I do the Mega May streams. And the thing is, I can't dash yet. I have to unlock the, the boots. There's going to there's gonna be a lot of... The, ow! What the fuck? Okay, I'm here. Yeah, okay. It's already a little bit harder. Zero's jump trajectory is not as good as um, X's in this game. Wait. Did I fall? Thanks for the first. Well... Let's see what happens here. It's always those damn bees. Getting close to the end. I'm sorry, but Zero's theme gets a bit repetitive compared to X's theme in this game. Bees are the mortal enemies to us bears. Yep. If this is Donkey Kong Country, it's Mega Man. Yep. Riding on cars. The, sh the ship should come up. Oh, wasps are worse. Wasps are worse. There we go. Here's Vile. All right, let's see what happens here. Oh boy. tired of this justice thing just die they even change his music <sighs> looks like I owe you one this time X the thing files our enemy now look Looks like I got out of here not a moment too soon. See ya. Just, just because I know I'm a B-class hunter, but I'll do anything to help you. Sigma and Viola are powerful. But if we team up, I received orders to hunt for Sigma's hideout. Don't worry about me, Zero. I 
I won't let you down no matter what. Go up, Zero. Sigma, Vile, we're coming for you. So this is what an alternate timeline is like. Yep. All right, so we're gonna start off with Chill Penguin. Because I want to be able to dash. It doesn't even say the name of the character. But we're going in. Here we go. Let's go. I just need a dash boost. I was hoping we play Axis Theme when he came in. Yeah, same. I was hoping for that too, but no, it was still playing Zero's Theme. Alright, let's go. There it is. It says W. Wait, it's Wily! Zero. Zero! Welcome! Oh, allow me to introduce myself. I am Dr. Albert Wiley. Remember me yet? No matter, Zero. I present a gift. You were my motivation in life, so I have hidden all of your upgrades in capsules like this one. So please step inside. These boots will grant you a swift dash ability. Seek out the rest of my capsules and you will become unstoppable. Now Zero, enter and receive the gift. Never forget, you are the strongest robot. Destroy all enemies, Zero. He has no idea. Holy shit, he has absolutely no idea what Dr. Wily is really about. Okay, much better. Okay, that's a lot better. Yeah, yep, Zero's being used by Dr. Wily, he doesn't know it. Problem is I can't go up there yet until I can get the, um, I need to beat Flame Mammoth first. To get the Heart Tank. That guy has seen better days. good. It's boss time. Let's go. Here we go. Live and let die. Fight! out of my face. Let's fucking go. No hits.
Let's go. Shotgun ice. Alright, we're going in to the next one. Alright, so... We're gonna go and fight against, um, Storm Eagle. Because Storm Eagle's gonna get me the helmet. Okay, so we get three things in Storm Eagle stage. We get the helmet, we get the, um, heart tank here, and we get a sub tank. All three. We're, we're gonna go get the hard tank first. There we go. So that's where the hard tank is. Now we're gonna get the sub tank. And that's coming up ahead. And then after that, then we're gonna get the... The, the next upgrade, which is the helmet upgrade. When we go to Flame Mammoth stage, we're gonna get the, um, this is the upgrade we're gonna get, and that's for the Buster. Stink Chameleon stage has the armor upgrade. So you take, um, half as much damage as you would normally take. So, there we go, we got the stump tank. Now we just gotta fill those sub tanks up. They will definitely be useful the moment we go and fight against Sigma. Not that. It's right over here. We just gotta go up. Go this way. Here we go. <laughs> I knew you would find it, Zero. Enter to receive the ultimate help. Go ahead. Try it on those blocks. Still managed to make it through, because they made Zero a little bit taller here. There we go. Because we're going to need that. Back to destroying rocks that are up above. Extra life. Yep. There's gonna be a couple of stages we're gonna need this for. All right, we're getting close to the end of the stage. All right, we're going in. Going up. This is where we fight. Go for broke. Fight. I don't have his weakness, but the Buster shot works just fine. Especially when it's charged. Let's fucking go. Storm Eagle has been defeated. You win.
Now, we got the Storm Tornado. On to the next one. We're gonna go and do um, Flame Mammoth. So here, we're gonna get a sub tank, a hard tank, and the Buster upgrade, which to get the Buster upgrade, we need the helmet. And trying to get the Buster upgrade is a pain in the ass, but it's very rewarding. So it's slightly harder. Oh, what the? I beat Chill Penguin, and yet, for whatever reason, um, there's still lava here. There's not supposed to be lava. That's... There's not supposed to be lava there. How the, hell, how the hell am I supposed to get the hard tank that's coming up? I grant you ultimate power. With the Super Z Buster, any weapon you absorb will be chargeable as well. Surpass all, all of creation. Yeah, because everything's supposed to be frozen. they found some sort of way to accommodate zero. Because I know for a fact that if, if I'm supposed to touch the lava, I die. But I'm going to come back to that in a minute. Oh, wow, nice. Another extra life. It's like they know. Does it freeze the lava? I don't think so. Let me see. There is there is something I'm going to try out. Let's charge it all the way. Okay, how the fuck am I supposed to get that? How the fuck am I supposed to get the, um, the heart tank right there? Because I beat Chill Peng- The thing is, if I didn't beat Chill Penguin, I would have expected, um, the stage to look like this. But I beat Chill Penguin. And I- and I, and I can prove it because I have his weapon. I think there is another way, but I, I have a feeling I'm probably not going to be able to get it until I beat um, Boomerang Quanger. So we're going to have to backtrack here at some point later on. Oh my god, Mega Man X! Hey, Magna Lupus, good to see you, buddy. Except, since this is April Fool's Day, I'm playing a ROM hack where I'm playing a Zero instead. And I'm seeing some differences already. Like, there's still lava here. So I'm gonna play Mammoth State. I'm in Flame Mammoth stage, and there's supposed to be, like, frozen lava. 
but instead we have actual lava. Yep. Because I was thinking to myself, wouldn't it be cool to play as Zero in this game? Because this is one of the... To me, this is one of the greatest games ever. Alright. Gotta get the tornado ready. Because we're gonna be fighting against Flame Mammoth. And we're gonna need it. Let's go. It's time for Flame Mammoth. We're gonna take him down. It's do or die. Fight! Let's go. Time to fight. Alright. I didn't have that much health, but that's okay. Um, we'll try it again. Also, they did say that you consume more of the, uh... Get ready to brawl. You consume more of your weapon energy, but the comments say they actually made it so that you take, like, opponents will take more damage. Fight! my the weapon that I'm supposed to use but at least the the Z Buster worked. You win. We did it. That's three Mavericks down, five to go. And then Sigma then we're gonna get to Sigma. Death to your enemies. Yep. Fire wave. Alright. So next up we are gonna we're gonna backtrack here for a minute to get the um, heart tank that's here. So we're gonna backtrack a bit. All because we got Flame Mammoth's weapon. So now we should be able to use it. Also, we have... Yeah, for whatever reason, I can't use the Saber. I only use the Buster in this game. Because in other X games where you can use Zero, he uses his um, Saber. But he could also use the Buster. In this one, he just uses the Buster. Yeah, apparently I don't have it. So I know X4 is where he has it. I think X3? I guess not in, just not in this game. Well, we gotta move. We got him. Nice. There we go, we can escape. All right, next up, we are gonna go to, um, so the next stage we're gonna go to is this one over here, Spark Mandrill. We're gonna get, um, here we get, um, we get the heart. We won't be able to get the sub tank until after we get the boomerang cutter. So we're gonna have to come back here later.
What's going on, Justin? Yes, zero. Ah! Also, he's fighting as normal because, for whatever reason, this uh, this this game just doesn't seem to detect the fact that I've beaten uh, Storm Eagle. Because Storm Eagle's ship, oh nice, Storm Eagle's ship is supposed to crash land in this stage. Changing the power and reject changing how the power works. for running errands, nice. It seems like they made one of us a lot more common to get. Something about this mod is not letting the stage changes as it happens, yep. I feel like that needs to be fixed so that they make it so that that there would be some stage changes in stages. Let's get the shotgun ice ready. This will be number four. Get ready to brawl. Fight! is what we call the Spark Mandrill Effect. You got Spark Mandrill. Electric Spark. If you know the pattern of how he attacks, he's the easy, he's like the easiest Maverick in the game. Like the hit stun makes him a joke. Stun lock the boss. All right, so we're gonna go to Armored Armadillo stage. This is a good stage to farm. Um, to fill up your sub tanks. So the only things you get here are the heart, the heart tank, and the sub, and the sub tank. Oh yeah. This game, this game rules. Like, because I know how I, I know Mega Man X One from the back of my hand. I, I think I replayed this. I replayed this game more than any other game in the series. The only other one I've replayed more than this, or almost as much as X Four. So one sub tank is filled up. Now I gotta fill the other one. I need the big drops. But let's move. That. 
Was nice. Oh, and a chip. We're getting there. We're getting there. Switch to this. Nice. Whoops, but at least I got the the hard tank. He doesn't even lose his armor. Really? Are you fucking serious? He doesn't fucking lose his armor. He's supposed to lose his armor. What the fuck, man? Oh, god damn it. Wow. Just making me use that. Get out of here.
Holy fuck, man. Holy fuck. Well then, let's move on. All right. So next up, we're going to go to Launch Octopus. So the only thing of note to get here is a heart tank, and that's it. Holy shit. It actually takes longer to kill him with that, um, if you're using Axe, though. I'll pick that. down this way Come over here. Come on, come over here. That won't be able to get that, so let's move. I can at least get this. There's another one coming up. Right around here. Ow, ow. 
No, get up, get up, up. Slide too, so I gotta be careful. Get ready to brawl. Fight! Spy my aqua shock. Get off of me. Ah, uh, that, that's my fault. I did it. So it's just heard someone say tuna alligator. That sounds like the name of Maverick. Yep. Take care, dragon. You have a good one.
Got it. Now let's go up. Time for the next one. Fight! Got him. That one was a breather in comparison. We're gonna do a couple, we're gonna backtrack and get a couple of things. You win! Hey, son, how you doing? Alright, let's go over here and get the heart tank since the floor is still lava. This is the first part. The second part of it's later on. Because later I'm gonna do Mario Party. I don't know if I'll be able to get that from here. See, I'm gonna. I have no choice, but it's n impossible for me to get that. From, so I know what I'm gonna do. Let me make a save state. All right, so I just need to. Um, Let me see. So what? All right. So this is what I need. Um, three sub tank. I need to get three sub tanks. Um, out of four, because I'm gonna get the fourth one in a minute. Um, all the upgrades except for the armor. 
And then I'm just gonna get the the heart, like all the hearts except for the one that you can get in um in what's his face stage uh Sting Chameleon because I have to get that one on my own. So basically, everyone except Sting Chameleon defeated. Three sub tanks, three armor upgrades. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna reset and I'm gonna and put a password. Cause I'm gonna check to see if the um if what I'm thinking of is good. So let me let me put a password. Let's see, so right here we got um That's why we're gonna check now. All right, still lava. Oh, I'm missing. I'm missing one. I think that's the wrong password. Because this one means I did not beat Boomerang Cutter, but I, Boomerang um, Quanger, but I did. But I did get that, apparently. Alright, let's reset. Let's set it up. Time to check, and then I'm gonna check to see which um which heart I didn't I missed because it says six out of eight hearts. We're missing a sub tank. Let's <laughs> go. 
Alright, this is the one I got. Did I get the sub tank here? Let's escape. Alright. Let's check for sub for hard tanks. <laughs> so I'm gonna backtrack to see if I got all the hard tanks. Like which hard tank I'm missing besides the one in Stink Chameleon stage. That's why I'm checking now. I did get that one, okay. I wonder if I got the hard tank here in this one. Because I want to make it so that I have everything except for beating um, Sting Chameleon. Because I want to, I'm gonna get to Sting Chameleon soon. This is a mod. Zero's not playable in norm normally. So yes, you're right. This is a mod. Oh, so I did not get the one from... So, so it's this one. There we go. Alright. That means that all we have left to do is go to... Uh, the next stage. Sting Chameleon stage.
Let's start by getting the heart. That's the last heart. Now we're gonna get the armor. We're gonna fight a robot here. Yeah, he was fully playable in X3, but X4 he like you could play you could play as him right from the start and have his own story. I know I'm close to beating him because he's smoke's coming up. Capsule comes up. Magnificent! You've even defeated RT55J. Now enter to upgrade your armor. Your damage will be halved. And instead of Dr. Light, we got Dr. Wily. That's true. of the Mavericks. It's do or die. Fight! Got him. K.O. Yeah. Fortress is not these coordinates. I'll meet you there.
We're gonna go to Armor Armadillo. We're gonna do a little farming right now. Yes, I'm gonna try for the Hadouken. I'm gonna need it. So that's the first one. Also, I just realized I'm missing a, a sub tank, so I'm gonna have to figure out which one is the one I'm missing. Is it this one over here? I'm gonna figure out which one I'm missing in a minute. This one, okay. I think four times or five times in order for it to pop up and you also have to have everything this tank is always getting filled up
some extra life. I want to see how Zero does the Hadouken. armor for access to the ultimate tech. Wait. Here we go. Oh, nice. We get the black armor as well. Alright, we're gonna go and Start the Sigma stages. Let's do it. Zero, you came. I'll run through Sigma's forces to create a diversion while you ambush them. <coughs> All tanks are filled up. I'm only going to use them when I really need to. Zero. A scuffle between the two happens. Surrender or X's history. Zero, forget about me. He'll just kill us both. <laughs> I'll give you credit here, X. You saw right through me. Zero, I always despise you.
There we go. Well, I won't let you hurt Zero. The sacrifice. Well, you only bought him a few more seconds. Don't worry, you'll reunite in hell soon. Impossible! Zero, how do you escape? Blast! You're harder to destroy than I thought, no matter. Zero, don't you dare underestimate me. I'll kill you. Zero, you okay? I'm glad. I need to return to base for repairs. Please promise me you'll will return safely, please. Why won't you promise me? Huh? This really does feel like we're in an alternate reality. Perhaps Zero is meant to be Trey X someday? This is where we fight the boss. And I know his weakness is shotgun ice. It's do or die. Fight! This is the worst boss in the game. But you have to know his pattern. Damn it, I fucked up.
Looks like I'm gonna use Z-Buster. Got him. to the next stage there's only three more sigma stages to go so what's next This one is going to be, uh, yep, it's this guy. It's Chill Penguin. Got his weakness this time. Match that we have in this stage is um, Storm Eagle. Will be coming up soon. Like this. Outside, which means Storm Eagle time. There's two of them. Why are there two Storm Eagles? Am I fighting two storm eagles? That's that's insane. That's insane to me. Like I don't understand how the hell am I am I even fighting two storm eagles right now? That's not supposed to happen. one
do this. Got him. You win. Well, that's that one. Now we got two more stages to go, and we are done with the game. Let's do it. Five rematches here, so. That would be um, Sting Chameleon, um, Armored Armadillo, um, Spark Mandrill, Play Mammoth, and Launch Octopus. That's who we're going to be fighting here. So we are fighting against Armin Armadillo. Fuck you! Now for the next one. Fill up that tank.
There we go, it's all filled up. Now we must move. Uh, let's see, it's Sting Chameleon. Two of them? Well, that's what I'm doing. to buy two of them. Yeah, because I play Mega Man X1 at zero. And it's actually, it actually feels different, honestly. It feels a bit different. Either give me two spark mandrills to fight. They better not give me two launch octopus. One one is annoying enough. Yeah, but apparently, like, it's a lot easier when you're just fighting one. But two? Two? Seriously? Okay, good. One. Good. Motherfucker. Fuck it. Maybe fucking use my my energy tank rather than sub tank. Fuck you, motherfucker. in a minute, just wanna see if there's any other drops here. Here we go. The last rematch. This is one of the worst ones to give two, like, win bosses to. 
Why would you make me do this? All right, well, plan B. That one's dead. So that one's gonna be dead soon. Fuck you, motherfucker! Oh my god, this fucking fight. Oh, right, this one. Moving faster because it has less health. Fuck you. We got one more stage, so we're gonna have to farm the, um, the other two. Alright, let's go. The last Sigma stage coming up. Oh wow, that's that's the track that we're using. These things are great for farming. For whatever reason, and like with this pat, with this patch that I have, they took out like those big energy, energy um, recovery to um, to drop from enemies. Like they don't drop. But I'm getting there. Getting some extra lives. Not that I really need any of them. There we go, now we gotta fill the other tank.
There we go, now it's filled up. Now we're gonna go fight Sigma. Here we go. <laughs> I've been expecting you, Zero. It would seem I underestimated you. However, enough of this. Heroes of nonsense. Humanity is beyond salvation. Surely you recall your past. Zero, you were a maverick after all. Who? give a damn about my past or being a hero. I fight only for the people. I believe it. You hurt X. You'll regret making enemy of me. Go to hell, Sigma. Go for broke. Fight! I didn't even use my tank, so... We're gonna have to recover the, um... The weapons a bit. Especially the shotgun ice. We're gonna need... We're gonna need to do that. Looks like it's all recovered. All full. Better try to do the Hadoken, because the Hadoken one shots them if you can pull it off. Otherwise, shotgun ice works. Fuck you! Now I have to switch over to the, um, the rolling shield. Live and let die! Fight! Let's <laughs> go. 
Oh God. Yes. KO. Impossible Zero. Why have you forsaken the Mavic so? Why can't you show your true self? I'll take you with me. This pile will explode. Now perish with me, Zero. Well, that's that. That's the ROM hack. It's, a, it's basically an alternate reality as to um, what would happen, as to what would happen if Zero was the main character, not X. Because obviously, like, this would not have been the outcome for Zero. It would have been X's outcome. After narrowly escaping with his life, Zero stands alone once more. Gone is Sigma's palace. Gone are all the dreams and ambitions of the tyrant, once called Sigma. Evil has lost. From the cliff, Zero reflects on the war and his actions. Was it necessary to spill so much blood? And X. Zero's thoughts shift the guilt for his partner's suffering. And a single question. What was I fighting for? <laughs> The answer, he doesn't know what he's fighting for. The reason why he has tendencies of being a Mavic is because of the fact that he was created by Dr. Wiley. And apparently he um, had the Roboenza virus that would lead to the, the Sigma virus. So his fate is doomed from the start. Well, that's that. So that's so that's Mega Man X Project Zero. Obviously, this is a fan-made hack that uses the the ROM of the game and just edits everything. So Zero is the main character, and X is basically the character that you would see every now and then. I think it's interesting. I kind of wonder how Capcom would have handled an alternate reality for Mega Man X um, as Zero. I know that in Maverick Carter X you have Mega Man X and you also have Vile. But what if you were able to actually play as Zero in Mega Man X 1? Hey Charlotte, good to see you. This is the result of a time traveler moving a chair by one centimeter. <laughs> Hey, that dude Zero, good to see you. This is basically my April Fool's stream. Playing Mega Man X1, but it was a ROM hack of, um, of the, a ROM hack of the game where instead of X, I play as Zero. And they made it like an alternate reality of sorts. And it, I thought it was interesting. And you, as Zero.
I wonder if this still has like the the stuff that happens at the end of the credits. I have to wonder, what if there was an alternate reality that replaces the entire Mega Man X series? Because here's the thing, um, if, if there was a point where, let's say if Zero was actually destroyed by Mega Man in the classic series because Dr. Wily created Zero and he was sealed as a result. So, if that were to be the case, how different the timeline would have been? And also the fact that Dr. Wily would be brought to justice. I don't think Sigma would have ever been made. I don't think Bob would have ever, ever been made, or any of the other um, Mavericks. Would humans and robots be living at peace? Or would there be some sort of chaos that pops up that we wouldn't know about? There's a lot that could be talked about there. A whole lot. It would be fascinating to see just where the direction they would have taken. And here it is. X, we found this surveillance video of Sigma. But I killed him, didn't I? Who is he speaking to? I heard about that one, Charlotte. Amazing. Work on my repairs, doctor. So he is the... As of your Wiley numbers, then his destiny is with us. Ha! Huh. Huh. Who's his doctor? It can't be Wily. Wily would be dead by this time. And the doctor that's currently seeing X and Zero are Dr. Kane, like Dr. Kane, because Dr. Light and Dr. Wily are dead. We'll probably never know. Because this is not an official um, hack. Like, this, is, this is just a fan thing. Oh right, I forgot about Dr. Dobbler. I honestly forgot about him. I didn't really like Mega Man X3 that much. Alright, well... That's the game. That was the game. So, that- this is the- this was the first of two streams. Um... I'm gonna take a little bit of a break. And, oh, I'm gonna take a break for two hours because... I gotta get dinner, and then after that, I gotta prep for Mario Party, because Mario Party's tonight. Um, except it's not Mario Party, it's Sonic Party. Sorry, uh, it's Sonic Shuffle. But with the Mario Party Madness crew, um, that's what's happening tonight. We'll be back at 8.30. So, I want I just wanted to do, like, a, a smaller stream to, um, to, like, get something going for April Fool's. So I got my April Fool's quota because I did not do an April Fool's stream last year or the year before that because I would have some sort of conflict going on. But this year, we got an April Fool's stream. So, because um, the last time I did April, an April Fool's stream was in 2021. So now here we are. Um, so I thought it was good. Like it's, I just didn't, I just didn't know what I was doing. I'm like, wait a minute. Zero Mega Man X. I, 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 just, I was randomly watching YouTube videos. I found this hack, and I'm like, you know what? Let's just do this one, and then I, I did it. All right, so, yeah, we'll be back tonight for... Um, we're going to be back tonight for um, for Sonic Shuffle Madness. Not Mario Party Madness, but Sonic Shuffle Madness. That's at 8.30 Eastern. Um, I will, I'm will. i going to see if I can find somebody to raid. Then after that, i got to get some dinner and then get ready for the, for the Mario Party afterwards. So, in terms of who I'm raiding right now... Um, uh, let's see. Looking at everything here, I'm gonna go send the raid over to Yoshels. Um, Yoshels is currently playing Chrono Trigger, which is absolutely one of my favorite um, RPGs. We're gonna go send the raid over to him. Um, and I had him on my show on Friday. That episode's gonna be up this week. Um, 
there's no sharing with shell shock this week but there will be one in um in the week after so yeah um but i appreciate you guys coming through We'll we'll be back here um tonight at 8 30 p.m eastern for the next part of this for the next stream for tonight which will be the mario which will be the sonic shovel madness with the mario party madness crew so we'll be back later tonight so take care um take care of yourselves be awesome stay awesome tell your loved ones you love them check them out as always fight for lasting peace and i'll see you guys later tonight and thank you for waking me up boom Yeah.